Welcome to Short Stories with Hubert Van Buren III. Today's story is titled The Last Will and Testament. Mark had been a young lawyer for only a few years, but he had already made a name for himself as one of the best in the city. He was known for his attention to detail, his calm demeanor, and his ability to think on his feet. When he was asked to read the last will and testament of his firm's wealthiest and most eccentric client, he didn't think twice. As Mark sat in the conference room, surrounded by the client's family and friends, he began to read through the document. At first, everything seemed straightforward. The client had left generous bequests to his wife, his children, and his grandchildren. But as Mark reached the final paragraph, he was shocked to find that the client had left everything to a mysterious stranger, whom he had never heard of. Who is this person? Mark asked, looking up from the document. I've never heard of them. The client's wife looked equally shocked. I have no idea, she said. I've never heard of them either. The room was filled with murmurs as everyone tried to make sense of the strange bequest. Mark knew that he had to find out more about this mysterious stranger, so he began to dig deeper. He searched through the client's records, interviewed his friends and colleagues, and even hired a private investigator. But no matter how hard he looked, he couldn't find a single trace of the stranger. Just when Mark was starting to give up hope, he received a call from a lawyer on the other side of the country. It was the mysterious stranger, and he was calling to claim his inheritance. I'm the client's long-lost son, he said. I had no idea that he was still alive. As it turned out, the client had believed his son to be dead for many years. He had been told that his son had died in a tragic accident, and he had never questioned it. But in reality, the son had simply been lost in the shuffle of life, drifting from place to place and never staying in one place for long. As Mark listened to the son's story, he couldn't help but feel a sense of awe and wonder. It was a twist that he had never expected, and one that he would never forget. And as he watched the son claim his inheritance, he knew that he had been a part of something truly special.